Good morning guys and welcome back to the channel. If you guys are new to the channel, I am Senna Steve and today's video is going to be about the Lexus. So I've been driving it around lately and I've been getting a bunch of noises um, and I think it's actually coming from the rear of the vehicle. I'm gonna take it for a drive here. We're actually gonna pick up the kids also and I'm gonna see if you guys can hear it if the GoPro picks it up, but they're making a horrible, horrible noise. And uh, I think I have it located. I think I know what it is. Actually, I do know what it is. But I'm kind of just going to make a video here for you guys of chasing sounds and things like that. And we're going to go from there. But before we get in the car, do not forget, Final 5 is now the promo code. That's right. Final 5, F-I-N-A-L 5, is the new promo code to get five times the entries, 5% off and free shipping to win this OBS truck. Now, it is the final five days, and that's why we're using that as our promo code. This thing literally ends December 16th, and I can't wait to hand it over to one of you guys. I'm definitely fortunate to be able to, to be in the position to be able to hand this away to somebody and, you know, do it as a giveaway. I'm actually super thankful for all of you guys' support and everything. So definitely head over to www.sendestevemerch.com. Get your entries while they last. Again, final five is the promo code. 5% off, five times the entries for the last five days. Also free shipping. So head on over, get it in, get your entries in while you can. Let's now jump in the Lexus and uh, I'll see if you guys can't capture the noise that I've been hearing in this thing. But other than that, I mean, the car's been a great car. No engine lights, no, no weird noises or anything other than this noise, which is simple. We'll get it addressed, but uh, let's get in the car and uh, go for a ride. Not sure how well you guys are going to be able to hear that. I kind of am trying to hold the GoPro in the back seat and drive at the same time. But uh, let me know if you guys can hear that. Kind of like a bearing sound. Definitely gets louder as you go. So let's, uh, let's get to the parts place. We're going to go pick up the kids and all that. But let me see if you guys can catch it one more time. I mean, that sound is absolutely horrible, and uh, I definitely got to get it addressed. And don't, don't. Oh, man, that's horrible. Don't yell at me for the tour belt or the seatbelt chime going on either. So, all right, guys, let's go get some parts, and uh, we'll go back to the house and see how, I'll show you how I diagnose problems like this. Oh, that is horrible. All right, now that we're back, and I actually already got the parts a while because I figured it'd be easier just to go get the parts while we were out with the kids. But further inspection, you can kind of do like a quick little glance in. Everything looks good. The wheel looks great. Come over here to this one. And this is like an easy telltale sign, guys, to see if you do need brakes or anything like that. You look at that wheel, not too crazy brake dust or anything. Come on back here to this wheel. You can see this one, you know, it's still a really, really clean wheel doesn't you know appear to need anything but when you look in you can tell it's getting low on brakes come around here to this other side sorry you're gonna have to bear with me for being winded but when you look at this side you can tell this brake is definitely seeing its better day so you can tell wipe it all off here definitely has some brake brake dust build up and it's definitely metal to metal at this point so let me go ahead and get this thing off and then guys we're going to talk about the f-450 because we have a video coming out on the f-450 the f-450's hurt it's hurt a little bad not crazy but definitely bad and uh we're waiting on parts so that was going to be my original video for today however you'll see that one probably tomorrow when the parts arrive but definitely stay tuned for that let's get this one buttoned up here and uh let's hope this is a problem let's hope the just brakes is our problem here All right, I'm gonna bring you guys in here so you can see. So you see these two uh, pins here that push in and out. Um, this actually clips in on the inside here or outboard uh, side and locks it into place. And then this actually rolls up here and locks into that grip right there. So I'm gonna go ahead and get it torn apart here. And then uh, once I get it back in, I will show you guys how to uh, how to do everything and how to lube everything back up. Make sure you lube everything, guys, because these cars, as they do get a little bit aged to them, they get a little sticky, I guess we'll call it. 
So let me go ahead and get these pins out and uh, we'll go from there. These pins actually are coming out rather easily. A lot of times when you get cars that are, you know, older or in Pennsylvania area, the uh, pins get stuck. But these actually seem to be coming out pretty good. So I'll take that as a win. And there's the other spring too. So make sure you set them to where you're not going to lose them. I'm going to put mine on the tire here. There's the pin there, as I was saying, is a hole. Not sure how well that's coming up in the GoPro because I'm not looking behind the GoPro. But there's a pin in this one, a hole. And then same in the other hole, or same as the other pin up here, there's going to be another hole. Um, these actually come out rather easy, which I am super surprised that they pull right out. But you can tell there's holes in both, and that first pin that I showed you goes in those. So now you can slide your pads out. They slide right out. That one's not terrible, but that one, as you can tell, is our problem, child. So let me get the rotors off here and uh, slap our new ones on. All right. Now, same like the F450 caliper. I'm not sure when. Actually, you'll see this video first. But uh, you can definitely tell it's metal to metal for a while. So get the uh, new rotor everything over here. Brake pads, uh, brake shoes look actually like they're in really really good shape i'm gonna also take some brake clean and brake clean this off to get some of the dust out <sighs> um but brake shoes and everything look good e-brake shoes so i call it a win all right let's keep going man i'm winded lately all right like i was saying go ahead and spray it down because they do pack these with an oil and uh, if you don't it will smoke lube here she always loves when you lube her too guys make sure you lube her and lube her right because if you don't someone else will See, the pin is now in. I do have this in, and uh, you put this on the outside to keep that pin from popping out. So, good to go. Let's get the wheel toss back on this side and finish out the other side. Alrighty guys, well I'm going to go ahead and end this video now um, because obviously it's getting dark. So again guys, you're going to want to stay tuned for the video for tomorrow. It is going to be about the F450. I'm waiting on parts here. Um, as you can tell, we got a little bit of a little bit of a mess. I won't lie. It's kind of, you know, because it's an F450, some of the parts are a little bit not interchangeable compared to some of the other trucks out there. Um, plus it being four wheel drive. So a lot of trucks that are, you know, this size out there are just rear wheel drive or their cab overs but you know we're gonna get all the parts we're gonna get this thing right but the lexus should be up and running here in the next 20 minutes or so um as you can tell we're rapidly losing daylight and it's probably only like four o'clock or so i think it's like 4 15 or 4 20 actually right now so it's like a little frustrating that we're losing daylight so fast as you guys can tell i have been very very frustrated lately with my fleet of vehicles but luckily like i said we have the Suburban over there. We can use the Suburban when we need to, and that's actually what we've been driving. Um, we also have, well, never mind. Um, anyway, but there you guys have it. If you like the content, please smash that like button. Please subscribe, and I will see you guys in an upcoming video. And uh, for, don't forget, guys, final five.
that is going to be your promo code right now for five percent off five times the entries to winning this obs truck so go get your entries first link in the description down below somebody's going to take that truck home in less than five days take care guys and we'll see you in the next one